Welcome to the Back Pew. This coming Saturday and Sunday at First Lutheran Church, we are going to be looking at prayer. Now, the disciples who have been walking with Jesus, who have been following Jesus, who have been observing Jesus, ask Jesus to teach them how to pray. Jesus says in the Gospel of Luke, when you pray, say, Father, and he goes on then to instruct them in the words we know as the Lord's Prayer. But before we jump into all of those petitions that we may know by rote, by pure memory, maybe we need to notice what Jesus said first, when you pray. Now, a lot of times we so individualize things that we are kind of living in a me and Jesus sort of world. But Jesus was very, very specific. When you, second person plural, pray. When y'all pray. When you all together pray. And then he says, begin with the word Father. Our Father, as we hear in Matthew. Abba. Jesus instructs us that God is our plural Father. God is the Father of all. God is the source, the creator of all. And so we come before God because God has adopted us as God's very own children in Jesus. And beyond that, this gets at the heart of something deeper. When we pray the Our Father, we're not just praying you and me or you and the people you like. It's a uniquely Christian prayer and it calls us to recognize that we are related to everyone. Perhaps now is a time that we need to hear this more than ever before, or at least in a long time. Our world seems to be splintered. There seems to be this movement of individualism and with a lot of polarization. It is the church that's called to be very clear on it's you, me, and everyone else together. This week we're gonna begin looking at that, exploring what God is up to and how Jesus instructs us to pray and what that might mean in real life. I hope that you're having a great week. It's gonna be hot, so stay cool. Again, the air conditioning is still working, so come on in, cool off. Rest in the grace of God. If this back pew has been meaningful to you, I hope that you'll share it either through the YouTube channel or you can share it through our Facebook page or through the website. Indeed, I pray you have a blessed rest of your week. I'm looking to see you on the weekend. Bye.